All right, guys, what is going on? Willis here, back with another Genshin Impact video. Pretty huge one for you guys today. We've got some Zong Li buffs. Yes. Uh, before we begin this video, if you guys are new to the channel, consider subscribing. I pretty much post uh, a lot of Genshin stuff, uh, looter shooter content. We're also running a 10,000 Primo Gem giveaway. So support this video with a like, leave a comment down below. And if you want to go enter the giveaway, join my Discord channel. Link will be in the video description. But yeah, today we are talking Zongli buffs. The time has finally come. Mahoyo has just dropped a huge, I guess, like patch update that they're planning for update 1.3. And uh, there's a lot of cool looking changes we're gonna be going over in this video. As you know right now, Zongli, um, like I'm not gonna call him garbage. I will just get like canceled. <laughs> um, honestly, he's a support character. Like you could probably there's someone out there that's probably built him as a main dps but for now as it stands he's a really good support to have on the team the petrify ability on his ultimate is just super powerful and it's just really nuts but let's go into the changes and uh, i guess i'll just give my opinion on some of it so um Hoya says recently we have received a lot of questions and feedback regarding zongli we understand the love that everyone has given zongli and the rapt attention being uh, paid to any future changes to him as such we apologize for the tardiness of this announcement concerning said adjustments uh we have organized and summarized player feedback um numbering in the tens of thousands during this time in game and out of game uh, through this, we have discovered that your feedback has focused on Zongli's strength in practical combat, the finer points of his ability usage, the geo construct system, and so on. After analyzing the in-game data and engaging in many discussions, we have decided on an initial round of adjustments. These adjustments will be available to travelers participating in the 1.3 beta test uh, version. The current adjustments are as followed and cover four aspects, enhancing Zongli's talents, optimizing the control and mechanics of his abilities, improving the mechanics of his geo resonance mechanics, and adjusting his shield. Uh, we'll continue to observe the performance of these adjustments during the upcoming 1.3 beta tests, and we will pay attention to the feedback of the testers. We hope that these adjustments will be able to improve everyone's uh, experience. So starting up, adjustments to his passive talents, dominance of earth. So Zongli's uh, passive talent, Dominance of Earth, what it basically does is Planet B falls additional damage equal to 33% of Zongli's maximum HP. So Planet B fall is his ultimate ability. So what are they doing on this? So the original effect, obviously I just read it out. So what they're actually changing is the damage dealt by the following of Zongli's attacks will be increased based on his max HP. Normal charged plunging attacks will be increased by 1.39% of his max HP. So this is actually huge. Um, they're completely just changing it. So instead of uh, his passive Dominance of Earth just buffing uh, his ultimate, it is now buffing his auto attacks, something he was extremely lacking in. His uh, auto attacks basically did no damage. So obviously we can see here in the adjustments, um, yeah, you can just see the numbers are just way higher. Uh, he's doing like what? So the left one is actually the buffed version and the right one is the version we have now. Like you can already see like going from 400s, 500s, 600s to like 800s, even a thousands at some point. That is just a huge, huge improvement. And yeah, his auto attacks are actually going to do something now. So yeah, also what they've done, um, they've done adjustments by the looks of it on his uh, elemental skill ability. So I'm assuming this is going to scale off max HP as well, 1.9% uh, of max HP. So image one here after the adjustment, image two is before the adjustment. Um, obviously this is test, so this could change in the future. Um, they're also changing planet B falls damage will be increased by 33%. Uh, of Zongli's max HP. So I'm pretty sure that isn't changing. That is staying the same. So that's pretty cool. Uh, they're adjusting uh, Dominus Lapidus, the holding mode. So the original effect was causes nearby geo energy to explode, causing the following effects. It will create a shield of Jade. The shield's damage absorption scales uh, based on Zongli's max HP and has 250% geo damage Absorption deals AoE Geo damage. If there are nearby targets with a Geo element, it will drain a large amount of the Geo element from a maximum of two targets. This effect does not cause damage. Uh, so the post uh, adjustment effect, uh, this causes nearby Geo energy to explode, causing the following effects. If the maximum number of stone steals has not yet been reached, it will create a stone steal. Um, wow, 
Oh, so as you can see, oh, okay. So while you're holding it, it's going to basically put a pillar down. That's really cool. Um, so image one after adjustment, image two before adjustment tests, not indicative of final product. Obviously create a shield of Jade. The shield's damage only escapes on Zonglings max HP and has a 150% physical damage and element damage absorption. Yeah, that's completely different to the other one. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. Um, if there are nearby targets with Geo Element, it will drain a large amount of the Geo Element from a maximum of two targets. This effect does not cause damage. Yeah, this is the same. The adjustment will uh, greatly increase the interruption resistance of Dominus Lapidus Holding Mode. Really, really cool. So, we've got some changes here regarding the Geo Elemental mechanics. This is adjustments to Geo Resonance, uh, Enduring Rock. So, this is pretty cool. By the looks of it... Um, yeah, when you use the holding ability, you're not going to get knocked down. So you can kind of use it as like a a block. So this is the adjustment version, and then this is the vision we have. Um, holding the ability is actually going to make it so you're basically a rock and you cannot be moved. That's pretty cool. Um, so the original effect increases um, resistance to interruption. When protected by a shield, increases attack damage by 15%. And then the post adjustment effect increases shield strength by 15 percent additionally characters protected by shield will have the following special characteristics uh damage dealt increased by 15 percent dealing damage to enemies will decrease their geo resistance by 20 percent for 15 seconds that's pretty nuts the thing i like about this the most is yeah look at this he's not getting whacked away like he is in this one <laughs> so much better so yeah, I guess finishing up, uh, we've got the Geo Shield balancing adjustment. So Geo Shields are adjusted from having 250% Geo damage absorption to having 150% physical damage and elemental damage absorption. Um, the affected uh, affected effects include the Geo Shield created by Zongli's elemental skill, the Geo Shield created by Noel's elemental skill, and the Geo Shield created when picking up Geo crystals dropped by the uh, hatchlings. I like to call them the Sonic the Hedgehogs. So this round of adjustments is not merely intended to improve the experience of playing Zhongli alone. We're also hope to better convey the shield of Geo playstyles. So not only are they buffing Zhongli, they're buffing Geo as a whole, which is way overdue. Like Geo, right? Yeah, honestly, like Geo needed a buff. <laughs> Let's be honest. Um, Geo playstyles are closely associated with him, not only for his sake, but to improve the experience of travelers who've been delving into the strategy layer of the game. It is precisely because these changes go further than pure adjustments to character alone. Uh, we've taken the time and utmost care. We hope to be able to give travelers a more detailed solution as opposed to hastily throwing out a general direction for adjustments. Uh, we truly hope that Zongli will be a trustworthy companion to all travelers and hope that you'll be able to experience a different playstyle through him, one that will enrich your gaming experience. 1.3 beta test server access will soon be released and we would like to take this opportunity to call upon all travelers who obtain access to not uh, be reserved into giving do not be reserved in giving us any in-game suggestions and feedback that you may have regarding these adjustments throughout the testing process. Additionally, if travelers have feedback or comments regarding any other beta test content, uh, you may feel free to send us feedback in-game. We will read each one carefully. Blah, 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 blah. Cool. So, huge. They're buffing Zongli's auto attacks. They're making his scaling better. So it then in turn buffs more of his elemental skills. He is now an immovable rock. He will not be moved. Look at him. He's just an absolute unit. They're buffing, obviously, the uh, elemental skills of not only Zhongli, but Noel. And uh, yeah, whenever you have a Geo Shield now, um, yeah, it's going to just absorb a lot more stuff. But yeah, I'll leave the link down below if you guys want to take a little read yourself. My opinion, this is pretty, pretty nuts. I'm glad Mahoya were doing stuff like this. Obviously, Zhongli is a very loved character, and when he came out and he wasn't <laughs> doing a lot of DPS, people were angry. Now, I do understand that, yeah, when a new character comes out, yeah, maybe they're not meant to be a DPS, but uh, I feel like everybody just wanted Zhongli to have a bunch of damage, and uh, he kind of didn't, so uh, people were angry, but glad Mahoyo are fixing it. It's really cool to see. Um, but yeah, if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Don't forget to go enter, guys, the 10,000 Primo Gem giveaway. We also have a cool system over on Twitch, guys, where you can actually earn Primo Gems from watching me on Twitch. So go over to my Twitch channel right now, hit that follow button, make sure you have notifications on, because just by sitting in chat and just chilling in the stream while I'm playing Genshin, you can earn Primo Gems. A bunch more information about that is over on the Twitch channel. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next one. This has been Willis Gaming, and peace.